Hey guys, how's it going? It's Tom here. I am uh, just started this virtual machine and I want to add another hard drive to it. So as you can see, in this Windows 10 virtual machine, I created a, an 11 gig hard drive, just enough space for the operating system. Now I want to add additional drives to this virtual machine. And in order to do this, you're going to actually have to start out by shutting down your current virtual machine. Go under your VirtualBox Manager, right click on the virtual machine you want to set up the additional hard drives, and click Settings. Under the Settings window, you're going to go down to Storage. In here you can see that under Storage, it's the SATA controller. Uh, you have an empty DVD drive, which I emptied in the virtual machine prior to shutting it down, and then you have your first hard drive, your C drive, which I set up as an 11.53 gig hard drive. <clears throat> so now in order to have additional space we need to add more drives to this. And you can add more drives by clicking down here. So click the SATA controller and click right here, this blue disk with the green plus sign. You're going to click add hard disk. If you already have existing hard disks that you know you want to use, you can choose those. But for this purpose we're going to create a new disk. I use the virtual hard disk, the VHD, click next. I like to choose a fixed size because if you read the description up here, so I'm going to go with the faster option and use a fixed size hard disk. And I'm just going to make it an extra, yeah, I'll do 20 gigs, 21.22. Uh, I'm just going to name it new virtual hard disk. I'm going to create it. Now as you can see here, your new virtual hard disk is added to your your current virtual machine. So mine is Windows 10 test and it's in here under the storage. So you can click OK. You can boot into your new virtual machine. Now in order for this to actually show up on the Windows machine, the Windows virtual machine, you're going to need to do some configuration in the virtual machine itself. Because as you can tell, when you first boot into your virtual machine, it still only has that one hard disk. So in order to get your new hard disk to show up, you're going to right click on this PC, click manage, You're going to go down under Storage, Disk Management, and left-click Disk Management. You must initialize a disk before Logical Disk Manager can access it. So it says Select Disks, Disk 1, you're going to click OK. And you're going to put it on the Master Boot Record. Now you have your Disk 0, which has your operating system on there and your disk 1, which is an unformatted hard disk that you just added to your virtual machine. You need to right click on that area, click New Simple Volume. And then just go through the prompts here. I click Next. You want to use the whole, the maximum disk space, so the maximum. Next, assign drive letter. You can have it assigned to whatever drive letter you want. Next, you can name it. and then finish. So now you can see name it. Drive E is now located on as a hard drive. You can close out of the computer management window and you should see it here listed as a new hard drive. So that is how you add a new hard drive to your existing virtual machine. Hopefully you found this helpful uh, thanks for watching.